Hello, welcome to my story about how I've created a custom spray booth for my model painting needs. As I was starting out, I did indeed use a cardboard box, but quickly realized it would not work for the long term. So my cardboard box soon became this. It all started with a plan. It turns out my cardboard booth was very close to the dimensions I wanted, so I continued to use that as a prototype and began laying out a design. I picked up some cheap paneling and a bunch of 5 8 inch square pine dowels. I then took a look through the air filter section at my local Home Depot to find something that would work for my design. The 10 by 20 filters were perfect, and I also picked up some cuttable filtering that I used as a secondary layer. Here you can see the wiring section of the air box and the added layer of filter that goes between the paper filter and the fans. To power the unit, I had a 12 volt 2 amp power supply that should work. The booth structure was assembled with glue and a nail gun and then the paneling was applied. I then primered and painted the booth. So here's an addendum to the spray booth. When I first built this spray booth, I thought I would just uh, put finger protectors on the outside and vent. Uh, into the garage area where I was painting and I quickly realized that I'm going to have to do something else instead. So I changed the uh, mounting for the fans and I put these wood inserts in with uh, some uh, screws that would protrude and then with that I'm going to be able to mount my vent hoods. I ordered a silicone uh, fan gasket to fit the fan uh, brackets that I have and then also I fabricated a paper gasket to further seal around the edges because I noticed I was getting some um, venting around the edges there as you can see when I was painting with some red paint. Okay I used wing nuts to attach the shroud with the gasket and so now both fans are connected and vented and the fans go up over and vent out through an air vent outside. Oh another addendum is I put some plastic sheeting up over my spray booth area so that I would keep um, all the dust out as much as possible. And then in addition to that, I added a additional venting fan close to the exhaust. And then that way I can just turn that on. I have a timer set up and I can just let that run for an hour so it'll continue venting even after I'm done painting. And a final addendum is I needed to add additional lighting. I purchased some more LED lights from one of my favorite electronic suppliers and added them to the sides of the booth. 